This is Simon Sark, and in this video we are looking at stem cells. So first of all we need to look at the function of stem cells. As stem cells are undifferentiated cells, and we looked about differentiation in the last video, mitosis and differentiation, which can develop into any type of cell after instructions. So stem cells are found in the early human embryos. However, adults also have stem cells. Stem cells in adults can only be found in certain places like bone marrow. Now these are not as versatile as embryonic stem cells as they can only turn into certain cells, not any type of cell. Now stem cells can stay in tissues for many years and they are only needed if other cells have a disease or are injured. But we are able to use stem cells now much more often as many people do die because parts of their body stops working. However, scientists hope that embryonic stem cells can be used to form any type of cell, and in 1998, two scientists managed to culture human embryonic stem cells. So scientists can extract stem cells from very early human embryos and grow them. So these embryonic stem cells could be used to replace faulty old ones. So to get cultures of one specific type, scientists control the differentiation by changing the environment, and this can be quite unreliable, however. In plants, you can also use stem cells, as the stem cells from plant meristems, and meristems is the place containing the undifferentiated cells, can be used to make clones of a mature parent quickly and economically, and this can be used in horticulture to clone rare plants. However, there are some problems with stem cells. So some people are against stem cell research because they think that the embryo should not be tested on as each one is a potential human life, especially as many of them are from aborted embryos. Now, stem cell research has also taken a lot of time and money, and some think that the money should be spent elsewhere. However, there are arguments that the embryo is unwanted and that people who are suffering are more important than the embryos. Furthermore, embryos can be taken from adult stem cells. However, there are also problems when taking them from adult stem cells, because when taken from adult stem cells, there is a risk that the stem may be infected with viruses and these could be transferred. But that is the debate about stem cells and also the function and how we can use them now in medical ways. So thank you for watching this video and see you soon. Bye.